Hi folks, this is Elgin Subway Surfer Bowling, your creative caricature marketing consultant. Uh, and just wanted to once again give you uh, a close-up version of a, of a t-shirt that I'm going to be selling soon on Cafe Press. It's my version of the I Survived Sandy um, <laughs> dorm, you know, that we all experienced here uh, on the East Coast in New York City. Particularly, we were hard hit and uh, my area, especially uh, area A um, in the Rockaways. Uh, this will be available soon, you know, on t-shirts and in a variety of other uh, items, mugs, whatever. Um, it's a uh, editorial illustration that, I'm, that I uh, had to do for the Wave newspaper and it will definitely available, be available uh, to you. I encourage you guys to uh, please buy it, <laughs> help the subway server out. It really will help to uh, um, support me, you know, in this uh, kind of tough, you know, unexpected financial time that I'm going through. And uh, it is really unlike any T-shirt I know that you're probably going to see uh, on the market. So uh, please support that, okay? Um, Man, what do I want to talk about um, right now? Um, just for those of you guys who were hard hit, you know, by this, you know, storm, those of you artists, um, I'm encouraging you to, um, you know, think of something creative to do. Something, uh, you know, not just to get your mind off of what's happening, but something in the way of self-promotion. I don't know, maybe go out in the street, draw random pictures you know, of the sites that you see. Take photographs. Um, become an investigative reporter, especially um, you guys who are comic book artists. Uh, entire books are made of situations like this. One idea is to go around your particular area, you know, or an area that's hard hit. Interview some people, uh, maybe draw some people, uh, compile the pages, bam, you've got a book. I'm giving you guys that one, you know, for free. It doesn't matter if everybody runs out and do it and I do it also. You know, you've got, you know, 100 million stories in a naked city or whatever the, the number is, but that's definitely something that you can do. Um, as an editorial artist, uh, one of the advantages of being an editorial artist is that you don't have to make up a story. The story is there. It's always there. It's always happening by itself. All you have to do is be proactive and capitalize on what you see, what you hear, and what you can make happen. And so this is really, really an excellent, excellent opportunity for artists to get out there and do something creative. Whether you're a caricature artist, maybe um, do some random caricatures, you know, of people. You know, ask what their opinions are about the storm, how are they doing, blah, 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 give them the caricature, say, hey, look... You know, just wanted to give you something unusual to brighten your day. Take a photograph of it. You know, turn that into a book. There are creative ways that we can definitely um, benefit from this. I don't want to say cash in because it seems kind of Machiavellian. <laughs> but there are definite ways that we can definitely um, benefit from this uh, creatively. I know that artists uh, during the 911 uh, disaster uh, definitely did things like that. Uh, those of you who have access to a camera, you know, make videos, you know, take pictures of your camera phones. Make sure you document this stuff, okay? Don't just let it go by, you know, carry a notepad around with you. Take down stories. If you have tape recording devices, you know, do many interviews with people. Have the questions, uh, you know, have the a series of questions that you ask beforehand. Compile this stuff. Put it in a book. I keep saying put it in a book because I really, really think that this, you know, is a good idea. Um, it's something that I wanted to share with you. I'm always looking for ways for you guys to uh, benefit uh, creatively. And um, that's really, you know, about it. Uh, this is Elgin Subway Surfer Bowling, your creative caricature marketing consultant. And... Uh, you know, it's November the 2nd. You know, this is probably going to go up much later than that, you know, depending on when the electricity kicks in, depending on whether I can get to 
a location where I can upload this successfully, hopefully today. But, you know, we'll check it out. We'll see. You know, I think I look good in this hat. What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> Take care.